Okay, so a question is asked whether nimodipine is helpful to prevent the vasospasm in anonymal SH or it is also effective in the traumatic SH. So understand that SH means subarachnoid hemorrhage. So understand that uh, the role of nimodipine is sort of well defined is aneurysmal SH or we can say spontaneous SH. It, it occurs because of the rupture of the aneurysm in the brain of a patient. So it prevents the vasospasm. That's why it is recommended to be given early. While in traumatic SH, the uh, subarachnoid hemorrhage occurs because of the external force or head injury. So in traumatic SH, the role of nimodipine is not very much well defined. Even there are not many studies or uh, guidelines which, uh, which suggest the use of nimodipine in traumatic SH. So your question is right. The role of nimodipine is defined in spontaneous or aneurysmal SH but not very much well defined in the traumatic SH so technically it is not much recommended in traumatic SH so thank you for asking and do read more about it